Now then, now then, um, another quick module video here. Again, I'm on the Mad Cartographer's Gate of Barovia map here, and this module is called Next Up. So this is helpful if you have a large ongoing combat, particularly with enemies that are spellcasters or have charged limited features. Very often you can find yourself in a situation where you didn't realize you were casting a spell off the wrong creature because you still have the sheet open for that one, or you had Skeleton Mage 1 open, you did something with them, it then went to Skeleton Mages 2, but you cast a spell based off Mages 1 sheet because it was still open and it can get confusing. What this does is, as it gets to each actor's turn, it opens their sheet and closes any others. So some DMs really don't like this because we like to have a particular sheet open the whole time and refer to it. Um, some like to just have that focus of knowing as you click next person, the sheet opens. So all I'll do is I've got three battle mages and Harry Human. I'm going to highlight them all. Right click, begin combat. There is a little quirk with this module that I haven't worked out yet, that when I roll initiative, it will open someone, even though combat hasn't begun, it's going to open one of these sheets. I think it's worth the, the slight inconvenience. So I'm going to click Roll NPCs. It opens one of the sheets. I'm not sure why. I think it's the first one that starts rolling. But when I click Begin Combat, we move to the top of a round, and Battle Mage 1 opens. So I can just move through combat. I can have him target Harry Human with a Firebolt. It hits, I'll apply the damage. That's the end of Battle Mage's turn, so I'll click Next. It closes his sheet and opens Harry Human. He can go through his turn, click Next, it moves to our next Battle Mage. Now it hasn't closed Harry Humans, let's find out why. If I go and I look in the options for this module, next up, so sheet position, we can choose for it to open at the top left. Sheets to open, or which actor type should be automatically opened? It may be, I think it's because Harry Human is technically a player character sheet, um, and it isn't. that's why it hasn't closed it. Uh, let's have a look here. Close sheets to, you know, we can choose to have a previous combat or all. Now that might be because you might have a boss that you want to keep an eye on all the time to remind yourself what their reactions are, but you want the previous minions to all close down. So you might change that just to be previous combatant so you have the boss open all the time. Um, you can choose to have the camera pan to whoever's turn it is as well. I feel like plenty of modules do that already. Um, so you might wanna you might wanna do that, you might not. Um, it adds an additional turn marker. I choose not to have that because I already used turn marker through a different module. So you will see there is quite a lot that you can do with this module. Um, yeah, the difficulty we have there with Harry not closing is because he's a player character. But yeah, I think that's a really simple, straightforward module. If you tend to run large combats, or if you know that you as a DM have been struggling with handling things like multiple spellcasters or multiple enemies that used resources, if you've ever been caught in that scenario where you realize, oh, actually, the only reason that player got hit by an arrow is because I used the wrong enemy and it was relying on bless. And now do we need to roll combat back? This just helps with things like that. Hope you found the video useful. As ever, leave a comment. Let me know what you liked, what you didn't, anything you want to say in future videos. But otherwise, thanks a lot and take care.